Well, happy Friday, everybody. I wanted to uh, show you this last, uh, well, second to last, there will probably be one more short installment after this session here. But uh, I'll continue on here. This was on the way to the Taj Mahal. We stopped at a rest area halfway there, and there was animals an elephant and a bear and a monkey, a guy with a monkey outside the place. They'd offer you rides on it or take a picture with the elephant. Or you could tell it was an old girl. She was an old elephant. Friendly, though. She seemed friendly. She, she was happy to see tourists, you know, and giving her attention. They took care of her. You could see, we fed her peanuts and stuff. She was a very happy elephant. Even one of our, our tour members uh, took a ride on her. Yeah, she she was a, a sweet elephant. They, they can be angry sometimes in captivity. In fact, here's the, the monkey on my shoulder. With uh, He had a bear, too. A, a tame bear right to my right there. They even had me sit on that bear. I... I was kind of uncomfortable doing that, but here I am, sitting on the bear, and uh, I think one of the other tour members were calling out to me or something, and Giddy Up, <laughs> Giddy Up Big Ben or, something, or Big Gentle Ben or something like that, I don't remember. Yeah, that was, that was something. Here, I got the monkey on my shoulder, and sitting on the bear. Yeah, this was at a rest area on the way to the Taj Mahal. Yeah, that was that was something. You know, they, they wanted a little tip for it. You know, they were out there making money. You know, they knew tourists would stop at this rest area halfway in between uh, New Delhi and uh, Agra, the city with uh, the Taj Mahal in it. But, uh, continue on here. There's one more of me with the, the monkey. He was starting to tickle my ear and stuff and it was it was a friendly monkey. He, he wasn't he, he was happy to see people. And it was like, Yeah, that was fun. But here is a building uh old I don't know if it's an, another uh tombstone like temple or something we stopped at but this was near the Taj Mahal on the way there we stopped at this place it was uh, you know we took a little tour through there it, uh, had this courtyard entrance right here I'm not sure what the name of that place is it probably has a proper name but, uh, but yeah here's a few at the Taj Mahal or no, inside that that building, right to the after we got into the entrance. Yeah, it was. Uh, I don't know if it was another tombstone like thing, like the Taj Mahal, or just a monument to an old past king, or or something like that. Yeah, there's one of our two members kind of looking back at me. I was taking a picture. Checking that place out. Here we are at the Taj Mahal. Same tour member looking back at me. That so that's how close that other place is. It's I think we visited that at the same time we we then we went to the Taj Mahal. But uh yeah, here's we're getting to the Taj Mahal here. That's quite a that's quite a gravestone for a queen. That's that's what the Taj Mahal is basically. It's a a past king had his wife buried right beneath the center there, and that's her monument, her gravestone to honor his uh, queen. But here, yeah, that's a one of our tour members were kind of all getting ready to head up to. Uh, Go see it. But uh, I think I may, this one might be that other building or buildings near the Taj Mahal. 
Because they, they had a lot of buildings near the Taj Mahal too. Yeah, here's a picture of the of the Taj Mahal. They have like a couple different platforms at different distances that you can get a perspective of it. And uh, here's an, an one on the, the nearer platform. And uh, there's there's one from the closest one where you you can stand and take pictures. It's it's like a platform in between the two sidewalks that head up there lined with trees and stuff. It's a very nice landscaped area. You know, the, that king probably had it built like that even back then. It was probably built like that back then. You know, you can... Uh, they haven't turned it into a monument. The king made it a monument to his queen. And that's... You know, here I, I'm standing kind of in front of it. And, uh... You can kind of see the platform there. I'm, I'm taking a picture the other way, looking out from the Taj Mahal. That's the platform. One of them, anyways. I don't know. And there, I think I have this picture in another uh, another video. This one where I have one with you know, my martial arts when I was 18 years old when I was first starting martial arts and I was really in good shape back then. And we'll do a play inside kick. Oh yeah, here's our whole group. We took a a picture out front. I don't know if we were arriving or leaving there, but one way or another we took a took a picture before we uh, either we're entering or leaving. I, I'm not sure. I can't remember if which. But you can see me standing second from the left over here next to the guy with the green shirt. Panaji didn't come with. He hung back in uh, Rishikesh. He, in fact, he stayed in India, I think, almost two more weeks or another month after a group left. This was like the last weekend or last three days before we left India. We uh, were in New Delhi, and we were staying at a nice Holiday Inn, and they treated us to a five-star, beautiful Holiday Inn. It, uh, it had, uh, the entrance guys actually had these big red turbans on. It was, it was quite something, you know, to see a Holiday Inn like that. But here's a few more pictures of the, the inner parts of the Taj Mahal. That whole area is lined with, like, uh, like precious stones, like argates and, and stuff. So they have all colored stones all inlaid in that, hand inlaid in that marble. I think I have, you know, there's a picture. I'm trying to take a close-up picture of them. It, uh, it even doesn't come through, even just me even looking at it here. So I can't imagine what the video, you know, but it doesn't really show the true... The true beauty of actually seeing them in person, it's really some inlaid stones, colored stones are all inlaid in that white marble. You have to, you have to get close up to it and you can see the colored stones all hand inlaid, all in that white marble there, of the Taj Mahal, those entryways. I can't remember if it had, maybe they were inlaid through the whole thing. I, I, I know it was the entryways, those big arched ways. They, they were all lined in there with inlaid colored stones. It, uh, it, it, it's quite a, quite a monument to his uh, queen, you know. She's, she's buried right there. She's, uh, she's buried right inside there. Oh, yeah, here we're up on the platform. We're on the Taj Mahal platform here. And there's taking a picture. You can see one of the posts, one of the four pillars that come up right there. This might even be the backside because out the back of the Taj Mahal, you don't really know it, but there's a river directly out back of it. Yeah, here is another building near there. And, uh, here's another one we're up on the platform I think that's on the riverside but there's a 
the king was starting his gravestone on the opposite side of the river. It was going to be a black marble Taj Mahal. You know, but he never did finish it. It, uh, I don't know if he lost power. I'm not sure the whole history there. Or if he just died and people lost interest and said we're not going to work on it or whatever. But uh, you can see the remnants. You can see the remnants. The black marble is on the other side of the river. All the remnants from their construction. It, uh, it was quite. It's quite a, quite a monument to see. It's in Agra, India. It was south of New Delhi. But uh, there'll be, I think, one more short session here. I have a, just a few pictures left, and that'll be the last of these. Uh, my India trip, once-in-a-lifetime trip. Taj Mahal right here, right up on the platform. You can see one of the posts in the background there. Have a wonderful weekend. Happy Friday, everybody.